Hello and welcome to this uh, video. Here I'm going to show you how we can uh, create some geometry in a space claim and make some parameters uh, for using in the workbench uh, for the parametric analysis. Uh, so let's get started. Uh, go to the space claim. I have created some sketches here to save time. So first of all, I will go to pool geometry uh extrude my shape use the space on the keyboard uh, put the 30 for this case and i can rename it to c1 for example then the second geometry will be this one extend use a space key on the keyboard uh, 45 in this case for example and then set geometry use the space key and 60 so I have three uh, geometry renamed to C02 and this one renamed to C03 so let's get start for making parameter so first of all in the group uh, tab you don't have any parameter if you add one parameter you can see uh, and check the parameters here uh, so <clears throat> just one thing for the par make parameter uh, in the dimensions uh, you need to work on the pool tool and then select one surface and one reference so uh, to make parameters so in this case i will use the pool tool select on this surface i'm going to uh, make this uh, height uh, as a parameter so let's see uh, click here and then use the ruler tool here ruler select here and then select the reference here so uh, when you select this one you have this uh, p so you can click on it to add as a parameter so now I have this group one as a parameter. So this height will be changed. So I can rename it to H01. So if I go here, click on this one, this 30, I can use 60, for example. So you will see this surface and this height will be increased based on this reference here. So I just use the control Z to uh, go back to this parameter so i can do the same for this two height also select here use ruler also you can select here then use the reference click on the p so this one i will use the h02 in this case use ruler then select this one as a reference click on p Rename it again to H03. So for now, I have three parameter for three heights here: 30 millimeter, 45, and then 60 millimeters. So now I have these parameters here in the uh, uh, workbench. If I click on the parameter set table, so you will see there are three the different parameters. You can change it and then use these uh, uh, dimensions for uh, different uh, analysis we'll close it for now go down so I will go uh, to do this one for this weights of this uh, cubicle for example the same process process will be done here select this surface for example and then use the ruler again select one reference for this case this width is 10 millimeter if i select this surface here and click here so i have this uh, one i will call it w01 and then 01 again for the first item so if i change this 10 for example to 20 so you will see this one will be changed so i will use Control z <coughs> And if you want to do the same for both of these two as a parameter, for example, if you want to 
uh, change this uh, this length for both of this cubicle here and here. You can select this one and then uh, hold the control key, select here, and then use the ruler, make one reference. In this case, I will select this one and then click on the parameter. So another parameter will be created. I will rename it to W01, but 02 for this case. So now if I change this 10 to 30, for example, both of these lengths will be increased. So I just go here and use Control Z. This is the uh, another parameter. For the cylindrical shape, I have uh, one uh, radius here if i select here uh, it's automatically this p will be appear just you need to click here so i will rename it to r02 for the second shape and click here so if i change this one to 10 for example it will be increased i don't want just here undo it in this case the same for the outer radius select here p then rename it to r03 for second uh, third shape and then 01 or i can call it uh, out for the outer radius and for the inner radius you can select here use the p and then rename it to r03 okay for the in inner radius so now you have all of this parameter in your uh, workbench in the parameter set table if you see yeah, open it you will see here all the parameters here you can set different uh, dimensions and then do click uh, and uh, i mean analyze your uh, problem here so that's it and thanks for watching.